Hattie Duty, everybody. Today is May 9th. I'm going to just do a quick hive check. I'm not going to go in too deep. I'm just going to look at the bottom of each box and see if there are any swarm cells happening. This is swarming season. We're about a week away from Mother's Day. And so for this area, this is the time where hives often start thinking about swarming. And Swarming, of course, is when half the population leaves with the original queen to establish a new colony. It's a sign of a good, booming colony, but it's not great if you're trying to collect honey because it makes a little break in your honey and ne well, nectar collecting. So while the original queen leaves, that means the hive is left with cells that are going to become the new queen. So she has to hatch, she has to get mated, and become fertilized, and then start laying. So there's a pause of a couple weeks before any new bees are going to hatch. So not that big of a deal, but also you lose production in the sense that half of your population is gone. There are measures that you can do to try to avoid swarming, and you can also try to catch your swarm too, and then you now have two hives. So um, yeah, anyway, it's just a quick check, just going to see if um, they're thinking of leaving. All right, let's go ahead and get started. All right, let's take off these honey supers. Super heavy, full of nectar. Beautiful. All right, we want to keep the smoke going. The smoker always likes to go out when we need it the most. Mm -hmm. So, back to this. I'm going to remove some of this drone comb because I'm seeing that's a way to reduce mites. Scrape this down here. and burr comb as I go along. See drones, but no sound my queen. So, look what I've discovered. Yep, I think these girls might be thinking about swarming. Because those are some pretty, that's a pretty built up cup right there. Let me check it out. Yep, empty cup. Empty cup, this is pretty built up. That has a larva. That has an egg in it. And that has an egg in it too. Okay, I have an egg and a built out swarm cup. So, I'm going to take a picture of 
that and send that to Li Ying. See what she has to say. This is just about to be capped. Alright, so you guys are thinking about going. Okay. So that's all I need to know because I saw one already. Oh, look at this. That is, that is a cat. that up because I've got a peanut in there. Look at this. Look at this. Right there. Right there. Do you see that? That right there is a queen cell and I think that's shaven down so she's going to merge soon. So these girls are taking off. They're planning on leaving. They are planning on leaving. My girls are going to leave me. Okay. So I just went in there quickly. I found a swarm cell and apparently last week when I came in here and I saw cups, I must have missed one with an egg in it and yeah. So that looks like it's she's going to emerge pretty soon. So I'm going to go consult Li Ying, my mentor, see what she has to say and what I should do next because yeah, I don't know. It might be unavoidable. I might lose them anyways, but um, hopefully I can prevent them from leaving. All right, stay tuned. <laughs> it's always interesting beekeeping, isn't it? Bye.